Hello Mac Warriors, how is it going? Welcome to your daily dose of Mac Warrior Online. Today guys we are playing the Black Knight because I just want to play the Black Knight. It's a beautiful beautiful mech and one of you gave me a build from, uh, for it in one of my streams that includes uh, four large lasers and four ER medium lasers. We are taking the Black Knight 6B here by the way, which has an incredible amount of structure. We have 78 in the center, 55 on the side and a bunch on the arms and on the legs as well. So that thing can rely on his points even though it lost its armor already but yeah we are doing something like a left and right punch combination so we have two large lasers that we fire on the right side with the medium lasers combined and two large lasers with the other mediums on the other side and the cool thing about this mech is that it's rather cold we have a good amount of heat sinks we have a light engine for survivability and it just performs quite well in this setup for me now let's take a look at the skills before we dive into the games and as you can see we are running laser duration as well as good old heat management range and cooldown so that's the good old laser vomit tree we go down the left and the right arm on the firepower tree and take the yellow nodes while we are doing it we have tilted our uh, our points into the right side here getting skeletal density by the way this is better it gives you more raw hp here which is nice to have and then cool run heat containment as well as rated deprivation and the double cool shot with a uav today that's the build everybody i wish you all a lot of fun in the two games that are coming and if you have that then don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and now it's time to hit the battlefield all right first game of the day we are playing the frozen city classic we are playing conquest we're gonna go over to epsilon capture that and then get down to probably the charlie 4 area probably bravo 4 as well now we have a good chunk of range in our little black knight here and therefore we're gonna watch over this uh, spot here on this charlie 3 area because sometimes light makes are pushing over there and uh, we have 400 and or about 500 meters that means that we can shoot them when they are coming over but they didn't so we won't now let's take a look what is that mad cat it is madness i thought i was seeing ultra twos and lrms or something so this mad cat is very long range oriented he also wants to probably stay away from the enemies that seems to be an ac or lbx victor mm -hmm, that's good we're gonna probably pay up with this guy Ah, okay, okay, I know this guy from the streams, I, I really, I really do believe that, uh, he is an active player, so let's go, let's go ahead and woohoo, find everybody, left side on the awesome, I'm on the awesome, I'm gonna keep staying here, no, 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 I'm not, I, I took the first wave of attack there, uh, keep up the pressure into Bravo 3, it's a lot of enemies there, lots of enemies to kill. Um, Hinite, you are a bit uh, too much up front now. I mean, being active is okay, but I don't think that you can do it yourself. I'm gonna help you in a second. First, we need to push those those guys down. Uh oh, our Victor is getting shred. Yeah, yet again, being active is good, but I think that was a bit too much. Mmm, not good. Not good. Our team is half down already, and we are here on the front line. Yikes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's everybody. Literally everybody. We need to get some kills back, which we actually just got. So that's cool. Sorry. Just pushing through. Just pushing through. I want to get into the fight again. And I want to get those big assault mags. Go for the rifleman in the back because it's a squishier target. It's easier to take down. Mm hmm. Easier in general. Go for the rifleman in the back. He's almost dead. Rifleman, please. If you see him, kill him. We are still one and two. Alright, we have a friend here that happens to be an assault mag. There's a viper. Okay. Here's the rifleman. Go for the rifleman. Rifleman hotel. Right side is crit. Actually, left side. Okay, there's more Dakar flowing. Holy cow. A Hatamoto coming around the corner. But this rifleman is probably toast now. Is he? Maybe not. Oh my god, I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> yeah, it happens. And now I'm blocking my teammate. To death. Come on, awesome. Get wrecked. Awesome is one shot. Right side. One shot, right side. Oh man, oh man, oh man. This fight is crazy. But I love it. What about you? You were very damaged earlier. Uh oh, missiles. Okay, I need to get out of this fight again. I am so critical. But hey, again, we have the structure for a reason. 
Santa on the Fafnir, Santa on the Nier. Gonna fight our way out of this. Alright. Got that. And all of a sudden, we are 6 and 2. That is insane. Absolutely crazy. Okay, uh, there's a blackjack sniping in Bravo 2. And I would say, we more or less got it in the bag. Oh yeah. Go for this guy's nose. Good. Next up, light mags down here. Also missiles. They are... Are they our missiles? I don't know. But what I do know is that the blackjack in the Bravo 2 area is probably not dead. I think he just uh, jumped out of harm's way and is still scooting around somewhere. Problem is, if somebody is coming around the corner, I'm so dead. Yeah, there he is. It's an ERPPC blackjack going down to the Theta spot now. Yeah, I believe that they are still trying to... That they're still trying to win the game by caps. Yeah, 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 seems like it. But you're gonna handle the blackjack. I am not in a condition to go for it anymore. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to capture and find some enemies while we are doing that. And there is a chance that we will find maybe some lights or medium still scooting around here. That is a viper, which is also extremely damaged already. So as soon as he's coming over, he is going to die. Ah, oh, almost. Almost got his leg. But now he is bound to get destroyed. Perfect. So, 11 and 2. Man, what a game. That was insane. I thought we were losing it because we were kind of running into the full firing line of the enemies. But we actually made it. Alright, Viper down. That means we're gonna go, up, uh, go over to Sigma, capture the last point, and then we should be done with it. Absolutely, we have 12 out of 12 now. So as soon as we have decapped Sigma, uh, sorry, as soon as we have capped Sigma or decapped Gamma, it should be in the bag. Let's see. No, we actually, we have to get everything. All right, here we go. Good job, team. Man, cool. We lost the laser, um, but our structure was holding, and that's the important thing, guys. As soon as your armor is gone, you might be a bit open to crits, but you still have a lot of HP left, and that's cool. So we got one killing blow, nine assist, one kill, most damage dealt, 713 damage with three components destroyed. And that was the first game. Let's go over to the next one and see how this will go down. Alright, second game of the day. We are playing Domination on the Viridian Bog, and I believe we are probably going to get a NASCAR here. So let's see if we can get on the high ground early. I don't want to get caught in it. I was uh, actually... I was playing a bunch of games today, and the problem is whenever I was calling a hold the line thing, I was there with one or two people, and everybody else was running away. So, I don't trust anybody anymore today, and I will just do what I'm doing, which is running away from the enemies, trying to avoid their fire, and shooting the enemies myself. That is the plan. Sorry team, I really want to be a good guy, I really want to uh, show the people how it's done, but I <laughs> just had enough of that, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Maybe another day. Maybe another day I'll show you the beauty of a firing line. You don't have to run around in circles, but everybody wants to save their own hide nowadays, and it just makes sense. It just makes sense. People are reacting to what the battlefield gives to us. And, uh, yeah, here we go. Uh, we're gonna watch this high ground Echo 5. We're gonna shoot everybody who's coming from there, but we're gonna keep our forward momentum over to the right side, to the Delta 5. That's important. That's a guy. I could, you know, grace, grace his armor a little bit. Uh, I also want to take the high ground. Mm, we can rotate around this big rock on the hill, so no problem. But it is important that we stay out of harm's way for the first engagement. There's a Vapor Eagle completely shielding me from the left side, so I believe he's gonna be the first guy to be encountered. And therefore, I am pretty safe up here, or I feel very safe up here. Yeah, you can see they are coming. They are coming around the corner. Oh, around the corner. Hello, Mr. Jägermeck. What are you doing up here? Huh? Huh? Are you shooting my friendlies? That's not nice of you. I have to shoot you in return. Oh, guy. This guy has armor. This guy has a lot of it. This guy has also friends. Hmm. Hmm. That's a bit tricky here. I'm kind of alone on the high ground. Uh, do I? Am I? No, not quite. Not quite. But you know what? Uh, since my guys are pushing in the low, I will try to keep the Jäger busy up high. And it seems to me like he did not really hit me. So I think he... Yeah, we can trade those hits. Now he's intimidated. Ah, oh, man. Hotel Jäger makes one shot in the car. 
core even. Uh, here we're gonna go and help out the guys in the low ground so that they can push up quicker. And I think I have to drop here. Uh oh. Hello, I sold Meg. Hello! How are you doing? I don't wanna be here. <laughs> cool. Cool shot is ready. Kodiak is not even facing me. That's perfect. And I would say, ah, come on, that was wasted heat here. Uh, I would say we have him down. Okay. Uh, hotel, the uh, Jägermeck is core. So let's see if we can find him again. There he is, still alive. So if we get up on the high ground, we will probably insta kill him unless there is a bad, bad blood ass trying to shoot me in the butt. No, 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 I'm come on, I'm blocked. Can me, can me, please not? There's the hotel guy still. Why? Come on, he's about to kill me. Kill him. Thank you! Okay, right, Huntsman in the back. And here's the thing, we have structure for days. I love this thing. I really do love it. Uh, important thing is that we keep up with the murder ball here. So, not falling behind. By also shooting the enemies to death. That's it. We can hide in the team cohesion here, so no problem. Hopefully. There's leg, there is he down. Okay, so I'm gonna just support fire from this point on, if I get an angle, like this. Huh, okay, artillery strikes don't care for team cohesion. That is the only weakness here, oh, that was my only weakness. But hey, we dealt so much damage already, that my teammates should be able to get things done anyway. I mean, it's cool that we see a murder ball going on here, but uh, on a dense map like Viridian Borg, you also have the problem, you could see that all the time here, that um, there is not enough space to fight. If you are too clumped up and if you don't maneuver well enough, then you will shoot the backs of your enemies and the friends. The friends, that's what I wanted to say. The backs of the friends. Now, let's see if my team can bring it to the end. I don't mind dying here, we got a lot of stuff done in our mech. There's also Estelle Fafnir, who very much disconnected from the team. I would say that was not his best round here, since again, we have a very structured map and those Stealth Fafnirs with the light goes. Dyer will turn around, there's a guy behind you, right behind you. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, they, they really need a range, they really need unobstructed line of sight. They really want to be uh, outside of the fight and shoot into the fight, and that's not what he really gets here. Alright, can we bring it to the end? It's 10 and 7 now. I'm not entirely sure. Let's see. Corsair with the racks and the mediums. Sure. Very good build. But he is staying in the low ground. In the meantime, the Fafnir trying to creep up on the high ground. Having a struggle. And the other guys... Trying to defend themselves against that Arctic Wolf. Still shooting flamers and SRM6s. Okay. The Dire Wolf is about to die. The Arctic Wolf still here. Arctic Wolf and uh, Delta 6, Echo 6 corner. Delta 6, Echo 6. It's an Arctic Wolf. He's cored. Alright, let's see. My teammates need to just finish him. The flea has the best chance to do it because it's the fastest mech on the battlefield still that is easily able to catch up to him. Um, there we go. Okay. Found him. Got him. Destroyed him. And we won the video game. Perfect. Alrighty, guys. Uh, again, it has been a bit of a struggle today recording videos, so... You will get this game, although it was a bit messy and I died early, but hey. Again, we dealt the damage, and I wanted to show you the strength of this beautiful Black Knight here being able to soak up a lot for the team. We had zero killing blows, sadly, but 10 assists, 1 kill most damage dealt, and 700 damage roundabout, with 3 components destroyed. That was your daily dose for today. I hope you enjoyed it, and if you did, don't forget to leave a rating or subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I hope to see you on the battlefield. Goodbye.